No, Miyuki. We couldn't get her back. But now we know that Miyuki's still inside there somewhere. Our words, our voices, they really do reach her. Yeah, there's four fights in the chapter. Before we reach the library, we fight Renamon and her first evolution. Then we went inside, we fight the illusioned Mew and Saki. That second fight, the third fight is still with Renamon and then like uh, her ultimate form. And then we, uh, she evolved into her, uh, her Mega. And we fought with her against the Master and his forces. So yeah, there's like four fights in this one chapter. My god. My voice got through to her. Yes, my voice too! Renamon, I'm sorry you suffer so much because of me. And thank you. Thank you for staying by my sister's side, Haru. Miyuki isn't like other humans. She has a special power. You mean the power of the Maiden? Yes, she wields a power instead of becoming a sacrifice. The power to open the door between worlds. That's why the Master is obsessed with her. So, what's the Master's true goal? Why, uh, is, uh, why does he want to use her power to open the door? To attack our world? Revenge, he planned to launch an attack on the human world. What? Revenge? For what? That's, uh, has the human world done anything to him? I'm afraid I don't know the details. Yet the master's world are dripping with the anger towards the human world. His goal may have been linked to this world to become engulfed in fog and started to fall apart. Then if you don't stop the master, us getting uh, stuck here isn't even the worst of it. Right you are, both worlds will end up involved by the fog. I want to rescue Miyuki from the master. Then we share the same goal, Renamon. Hold on, Takuma. GG might say we have the true uh, choice but uh, uh, but to defeat Miyuki in the end. I know he did, but I want to keep looking for a way to avoid that until the very end. The way things are now, my, he uh, my heart breaks to thinking about what Miyuki is going through. Besides, we know for a fact that boys can reach her now, right? And we keep calling out to her and that helps Miyuki uh, regain control for, for herself. Yeah, let's do everything we can. Rescue her would be a happier ending for everyone. You guys, Leon, Leon, us, you know, you're the ones uh, of uh, uh, us as Haru for a bit there. Fine, fine, I'll help you out as long as me you stay out of the crosshairs, okay? Come with us, Renamon. We'll see Miyuki and this world together. Okay. All right, end of chapter ten. Let's go. We can get through like the first little bit of chapter eleven and. Um, Stop at a free action so I can do some uh, free battles. Get grind up some um, ultimate uh, mega tablets, slabs, whatever you want to call them. I need like six or seven, and I already have one. Closing, shrinking the world I created. If I don't hurry, I will be too. No, I will not allow it. I cannot stop. My ultimate desire will be realized. Death. What does the master look like? Is he even a Digimon? Or is he one of those Zenzuku things he they, they made for this game? Where am I? The offering! Quickly, the offering! Where's Pygmon? I heard something. What is that? Good morning, my dear priestess. You're what? Just hearing that voice uh, says shiver down my spine. It's like uh, direct, uh, directly inside my head. This is too much. Whatever you are, you're scaring me. I will not hurt you. Let me see everybody's uh, affinities. Yeah, there's no way I can get any of them across like 70. There's just no way at this point. Yeah, uh, alright. I will not hurt you. Who are you? Oh, precious Miyuki. You are my life. What? Now come, come here. Oh, this is getting really creepy here. Here, you want me to come to you? Which shall you, my ultimate desire, will not be realized. Your ultimate desire, you mean there's something you want? I cannot forgive that wretched family. Therefore, Miyuki. Therefore. He seems angry. Like, really angry. Come now, Miyuki. Come to me. To me. 
And if I do, what are you gonna do to me? Hurry now, come to me! No, I don't want to! Don't leave me! No, my precious princess, please don't leave me! What's going on? My head feels weird, like my mind's being taken over. I can't take this. No, no! I can't let him have his way. I know uh, that much, but still. What am I supposed to do about it? I don't know. After some, why are you Haru again? After sudden battle with the master of the library, we made it up with Haru and Renaman since we all uh, want to save Miyuki, and uh, uh, then made the safety back to school. After that, everyone passed out like a lawn, including Renaman, who was injured. The next morning, Renaman gathered everyone in the cafeteria when we woke up. Renaman, what's going on? Why'd you take on Haru's form again? We know who you are, who you really are now, so we keep. Uh, well, so why keep pretending? I looked this way for so long that my body naturally taken his appearance. Hold on. So you're not just like putting up this guy, you are actually morphing into like Haru's form? Is that what's happening here? Like, I thought, I thought you were just like taking his form for some. Like, you were just like casting an illusion. But you are actually taking his form. Okay. Uh, but yesterday you look like Renamon. Well, I can't find in this uh, in this form, obviously. <laughs> so basically, Harm's form is more natural for you uh, for you at this point. Like you feel more relaxed in this body. Hey, don't ignore me. Oh, shut up! After all the time that Miyuki's uh, uh, side as Haru, it just started to feel right. But isn't it painful to stay in that form? At first it was, but the strength of it was worn off over time. And I like the look of uh, Miyuki's face when she sees me. So, you can forget what, uh, what I said yesterday. Intriguing. So, why'd you call us here? You got something important to announce? Right, I thought we should take uh we should talk about where Miyuki is. You mean you know? Miyuki is in the shrine. The, the shrine? You mean the inner shrine uh from before? That's not that's the one. Are you certain? You think I lied to you at this point? The master's true body is in the inner shrine. So Miyuki is is there too. She must be. I don't think she's lying, Takuma. But if that's true. I can't believe it, the Master and Miyuki have been right under our noses. Looks like everyone else is just as surprised as I am. I'm shocked, I never thought the enemy uh, could be so close. We are walking around there so many times. I know, it never even crossed my mind. Like they said, it's easier to miss what's right in front of you. The shrine didn't seem large enough to hide multiple people though. Maybe the inner area goes further than I thought. But I searched the shrine so many times, I couldn't believe it. We're working together on this, right? Or do you doubt me? Miyuki uh, used to say Haru was really stubborn and never changed his mind. So I guess I'm just being the same old Haru. That's an interesting way to put it. But it's easy to see where the professor is coming from, right? In other words, you don't trust me? That's not what I mean. I just, like, want some proof. It will make sense if you get to the shrine. Will it? Renaman isn't offering much in the way of details. But like Agumon said, he doesn't seem to be lying. I trust Renamon. Renamon wants to help Miyuki and wouldn't lie to about her. I can't disagree with you there. Just look at those eyes. They look like uh, Sakuman uh, did when he protected me, all intense. Yeah, I guess uh, that's the look of uh, wanted to protect someone you care about. True, plus, we all know of, uh, how bad Renamon wants to save Miyuki. We can trust him on this, right, Professor? I guess I'm the stubborn one then. I'm sorry, Renamon. As long as Miyuki is safe, that's all I care about. So, 
Okay, so now we know where the bad guy is, but how do we beat him? He's the ruler of this world. We gotta have a plan. Uh, then let me make a suggestion. Let's focus on rescuing Yuki before we try to beat anyone. Once we got her back. Yeah, then what? We run like hell! Then we go somewhere safe and use her power to get home. Good plan, Minaru. Sounds perfect. I know, right? <laughs> it's amazing for you. Better than I could have expected. Come on, can't you just be nice for once? What do you think, Takuma? Personally, it seems pretty realistic to me. It's not bad, but I don't think it will be that easy. What's that supposed to mean? Yeah, Takuma, what do you say not that easy? Uh, I can't really explain it, but this world and ours seems to be able to affect each other. As long as something's wrong in this world, our world will be off too. Right, so just running away won't solve the problem. I guess... We gotta fight this master after all. Even though it might be impossible to win. Oh, uh, now hold on, it might uh, not be necessary to defeat him. You wanna talk to him? What, what, what are you talking about here, dude? Huh? Perhaps restoring the world and defeating the master should be viewed separately. What's that mean? But we can't save the world without defeating the master, right? Not necessarily. You mean we don't have to be the master to save the world? Do you have some special uh, insight on how to save the world then? I'm not exactly sure how, but I think we could explore some other solutions as well. But if we don't, uh, we don't know how, then all we can do is fight, right? Yeah, right now that's the only choice we have. Is there really another way which help fighting? Since our world are connected, it seems like we have uh, to beat the master. Maybe we should focus on saving Miyuki and getting home like Minaru said. Once we're back in our world, we can rethink how to defeat the master. But if there's really another way to, uh, like the professor said, we should look out into it. Uh, beating the master, find another way. Find another way? I don't know which is the right answer. On this, at this point, I don't really care. It's best to find a way which are fighting, like the professor said. Yeah, but how? I don't know, that's why we have to find it. And what happens to Miyuki in the meantime? I can't let the master keep her any longer. If you are saying rescue Miyuki is in the goal, then I'm done. No, no, that's still our goal. I want to help Miyuki too. Well, that whenever we beat the whether we beat the master or not, first we need to rescue Miyuki. That's the true. Uh, that's as true as it always been. Good. But it will be hard to stop the master without beating him. Don't forget that. If Renamon says so, honestly, the uh, the chances are starting to look close to zero. We can't do uh, we can't do nothing, uh, that's for sure. Anyway, let's head to the shrine. That's the only choice we uh, really got, in, in my opinion. Yeah, whether we beat the master or not. Uh, either way, we need to her power. In other words, we have to rescue her if we want to go home. Yes, but that's not uh, why we're rescuing her. I have to rescue her regardless of her power. But if we go to the shrine, we might end up fighting the master, right? Everyone's face has got uh, really intense. No matter how uh, prepared we are, the idea of facing uh, the monster isn't. Uh, the master is still scary. Uh, I'd be lying if I say I'm not scared too. Hey, Takuma, everyone seems kind of on edge. Yeah, they do. Perhaps uh, before we head to the shrine, we should check in. Uh, check in with everyone. Check in with everyone, huh? Yeah, maybe so. It'd be dangerous to go near the master. If, uh, we were on easy on entries, and that's putting it lightly. We probably would use a moment to get our emotions under control. We can't just uh, rush f uh, forward immediately because that's, uh, that's what we decided. Each person needs uh, to really be on board with this or will never win. I think it's like the professor and Renamon said. We should deal with our emotions before headed to the shrine. We can gather back here afterwards. Uh, hold on, let me see here. Who's by the shrine important here? Uh, head here and use your phone to check amongst the, the trees right side of the area to find a precious number. Spirit of a chapter 5, I don't care. And uh, getting them all, go ahead 
Uh, claim your burst. I don't care. Uh. Okay, so like this chapter doesn't give you a lot of affinity. Uh, okay, you only have four free actions. So, okay, so what's by the school? Okay, yeah, Phoenix Mom, Mega is starting to show up. So what I need to do is just go through through these fights and quit. Let, let me try it right now. See if I can actually do it. So I can uh, so I can trigger up a Marine Engineman fight. And uh, then, like, ask from him, ask Marie Andrewman for items. Uh, just put whoever in here doesn't doesn't matter um okay so we I need six so one two three f uh, one two okay hold on four five and uh, probably Renamon uh, it's, it's good Renamon already has a mega so I already have a data mega so that's good that's good okay yeah that, yeah that's not too bad then uh, I will still want a little bit more, like maybe six or seven more um, ultimate mega slaps. Uh, yeah, just give up. Give up to return to the map. Reward item we will not carry. It doesn't matter because I don't want any reward you have. The only uh, poke Digimon that gives you... Okay, there we go. It's a new, uh, different free battle now. So, Frost Area, does this area change? Yeah, it does too. Okay, so just keep doing this until you get a Marine Angema and talk to him until you get his Mega. Got it. Uh, let me see. Cafeteria, talk to you. I can talk to maybe two people right now. And I'll probably end the stream. Uh, is that the way she's getting ready for the final battle? I should talk to her. Okay, unless this gives me like 10 to 20 affinity ups in one go, I'm never going to see their megas, which sucks about this game. Because like, they they, they went some like interesting route on like choosing their the, the evolutions, but like they made this such a pain in the ass to actually unlock them, it sucks. And like, unless you read it online that the affinity are just what determines determines whether you get ultimate or mega because the champions are the, are like in this through the story there's like there's no way you don't get the champions but there's a real po possibility if you answer them wrong you won't see a single mega and ultimate in this game which just like just just horrible game design uh dude like at this point i'm we're almost done with the game i'm not gonna keep complaining about it but this is just god awful Oh, Labramon, what are you doing here? Takuma? Oh, nothing. I was just thinking back over everything that happened. You always uh, prepared a meal for us. It's not surprised you're comfortable in the cafeteria. Yes, you're probably right. Still, that's not all I was thinking of. How so? Uh, what really stuck with me uh, was the time I was captured by uh, the Kugamon. Wait, really? That's not exactly something I want to remember. Yeah, even so, it's linked to an important memory of mine. The time that Labramon fought so desperately to protect me? Of course you were uh, already super important to me back then. Thanks, Labramon. I was so happy when you did that. And I saw you come to rescue me. I felt uh, this warmth I never known before. It felt so strange, uh, like a uh, gentle feeling uh, spreading through my chest. I felt the same way, Owen. I could already tell how uh, special you were. Yeah, that was the moment I felt our bond. You know what I mean, don't you, Takuma? Yeah, some uh, more than you realize. I'm sure everyone uh, here knows exactly what you mean. Of course, I get it too. Me and Takuma have the, uh, that kind of bond. Mm, yes, I, I think you're right. Labram and me, Takuma and Akuma, it's not just us. Monaru, Saki, Kaito, Miyu, 
All of us are connected by these kind of bonds. The fact that I come to think this way is definitely thanks to you, Takuma. What? Me? Yeah, no matter what, you are always support and, uh, supported and encouraged us. No, that's kind of embarrassing to hear her talk like that, but I'm glad to. When I think is how I only came to feel about our bonds, I can't help but think it's because uh, she's the one who helped build our relationships. And besides, we were saved by Oi on countless occasions. So hearing her talk like this, I feel like I need to say something too. The feeling is mutual, I should be grateful. The feeling... Uh, cafeteria... Okay, the feeling is mutual. I'm uh, grateful to you, uh, to you as you are to me, so the feeling is mutual, Oi. Oh sure everyone else feels the same way? Everyone else? Yeah, you do the thing I can't, and we help you with the things uh, uh, that are hard for you. And that way, all of us grew together. Uh, uh, grew together. I'm sure of it. Me, you, everyone, even Aquaman and the others. I think so too. Yeah, exactly. So, everyone supported each other together and grew. I see, that makes sense. Thanks, Takuma. I know I, could, I know I can rely on you. Taking, uh, talking to you is clearly, uh, cl has cleared a bit of foggy from my head. Now I can go save Miyuki without any hesitation. Were you hesitating before? Oh yeah, glad to hear it. Yes, yeah, so I'll have back with everyone else in a bit, uh, in a bit. Please wait until then. How much affinity did that give me? If they give me more than somewhere between like 10 to 15, I might still have a shot at unlocking the Megas. Otherwise, I don't think it's gonna work. Yeah, it only gave me like, I think that gave me 6, 5 to 6. Yeah, there's no way that this is gonna let me unlock a Mega. Yeah, okay. Well... Hmm... <sighs> Yeah, alright, okay, I guess. Ah, uh, alright. Yeah, just get this over with. The game, the game's not great. Honestly. Corridors. I see Saki over there, what's she doing? Hey, get in here, Falcomon. I don't Falco what what what? Get in there's Floramon. Oh Floramon. I don't get it, but uh, if you say so like this. No, you got you're out of frame, get closer, or you get cut off. Uh how about I I'll help too. Oh thanks guys, but I got this. And selfie gives more of that day in the life wipes kinda of fine fun fun, right? Day in the life. That's what I said. But this is, I know, this isn't even the world we know. Our time here has uh, been as far normal, uh, far, uh, as far from normal as it can get still. This place is normal for Florimon and the others, and we are with them, right? So it's like having Florimon around is a, a new normal for me. Man, this is hard to explain. Sure, but I think I get what you're trying to say, Saki. Yeah, this is our day, day in the life. <laughs> I'm so happy to have Saki and the part of my life. Saki's gonna to uh, tougher somehow. I got the impression she was a bit um, of a space case where we, um, we first got here. But now she became such a great a partner to avoid. Uh, I said uh, I she said her sick body makes her tired easily, but she seems energetic to me. We may have headed back to our world soon, but this is the one makes Saki stronger. So like that's sh is is her il illness doesn't like affect her in this world? Um, I'm glad we came here. That's the right answer. Got it. Uh, there might be a, a bit, uh, a better way to say this, but I'm, I'm glad we came to this world. Takuma, where did Jack come from? I just, I was thinking back into your know, time here. You got, uh, you got so much stronger Saki than all of us have, I think. Um, you've become the most reliable partners I could ask for, Takuma. Say, Saki's no sloth, uh, slouch either. She's the best partner ever, you hear me? Even the fact uh, that these guys can talk about us like this. Is uh, all thanks to this world, that's what I think, so I'm happy we came here. <sighs> yeah, that's true, isn't it? I was so scared and clueless when we got here, I was just dragged everybody down, I just dragged everybody down. Now that I'm glad we came, I, uh, I could trade, uh, I wouldn't trade getting to know Florimon for anything. Saki! 
Now then, would you say we snap a few selfies before we head to the shrine? This might be our last chance. I want to make memories where we can. Saki, I'll take as many as you want. Hey, thanks for Florman. Uh, so hey, you know where uh, you know where we'll be until we all meet up. Right, got it. I'll see you later. Okay, how many is that? I think that's four for Saki. Dude, this is chapter 11, and I know this game has 12 chapters. On chapter 11's affinity up, you give me four affinities. Yeah, okay. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm out. Um, I, ca I can't. Like, um, I'll be back to stream this game on Friday. Hopefully, I can, like, beat chapter 11 on Friday. So, I can, like, um, so I can finish this game on next Monday, hopefully. Yeah, I can't. I can't wait to finish this game. So, uh, Nintendo, uh, if you are watching this on Twitch, follow the channel. If like pretty through doing, if you are watching this on YouTube, you like, subscribe, comment if you want. If you want to watch it live on Twitch, I'll drop the channel link down in the descriptions. Uh, if you want to watch more Digimon Survive, come back on Friday. Tomorrow is the Xenoblade Chronicles three playthrough. I'm going to use my free time to grind up maybe like six to seven. Mega slabs, so I will have like seven to eight of them, uh, so I can use to basically evolve whatever I want uh, to get to to see it evolve to mega. So yeah, that should be pretty fun. But uh, until then, all right. See you guys on the next time. Goodbye.